Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. This is Rusty78609, and I'm in here at the Rockport Marina in Rockport, Texas, on a cold morning. It's probably about 25 degrees wind out of the north, and I'm not going to be long on this video, but I want to give a shout out to uh, there's two group, two young couples I watch on YouTube uh, periodically. One is uh, Sailing Ma Magic Carpet, and the other one is Sailing Uma, and it's just two young couples sailing their sailboats around the world. And they're, you know, I'm, I'm, here I am, I'm in a motorhome, okay? This is a Class C motorhome. Is that a sailboat? No. It, it is me. I, I sail on the land. But, you know, it's got all the stuff just like a sailboat has. You know, it's, it's fully self-contained. And so there's a little common ground. You know, you, you have to be a little more careful at sea. But I just thought I'd come down here to the marina and look at a sailboat because I haven't seen a sailboat in a long time. And I, that way I could kind of get a feeling for what these people live on. Now these are smaller sailboats than the, the one that uh, Sailing Uma and Sailing Magic Carpet do. But anyway, how are you doing, sir? Oh, I'm fine. Cold? Yeah, a little. Uh, anyway, here's one up here that may be about the size of uh, their sailboats right over here, so I'll get an idea of what their living conditions are. This is, I don't even know if this is the same size or not. Uh, this one right here looks like about a 30-something footer, and it's got a single deal, whatever you call it, sail. But, uh, yeah, for those people like these, those young couples that go out sailing like that, you know, that's tough. You know, you got to be a handyman and uh, pretty well uh, independent because, uh, yeah, when you're out there by yourself, you're on your own. It's just like me alone in my RV traveling around the United States. And uh, yeah, this is another one right here, a nice big old sailboat. Wow. And uh, yeah, you just, uh, you got to be kind of a adventurer, you know. Uh, but yeah, here's one here. This one, they've even put in an air conditioner on this one. I'll walk out here. I want to look at one up close anyway. This is, uh, here, this is, now this one right here, this is probably pretty expensive right here. You know, this is a big old good one. And uh, so we'll look at it. Yeah, it's got a, yeah, I don't know, this might be about the same size as one of theirs. I don't know. And then there's one over here, a little smaller, but it's got a dinghy or whatever you call it. I'm a little dingy myself, but uh, yeah, so for you guys that want to go sailing, uh, here's what your accommodations would be. Yee. Uh, you know, some people may live, they may live in these, you know, some people do live, uh, you know, park their boats at the marina and, and live in them. I'm probably, somebody's probably in there sound asleep or whatever. Yeah, there's trucks parked here in front. Yeah, there's probably people living in these things. Because you can, I think. But anyway, I'm in Rockport, Texas. It is a cold morning, and uh, yeah, here's one. Here's a here's a, here's one taking a pee. <laughs> this yacht is taking a pee pee. <laughs> How rude! <laughs> yeah, these yachts, those yachts are expensive, I'm sure. But uh, we're just walking along here. I'll let you see the yachts, yachts. There's a big one down here. Let's go see what old Big Daddy's got. This one's named Hard Times. <laughs> he wasn't on Hard Times till he bought that yacht. But here's a big old good one up here. This thing is a ship. You know, there's always one, isn't it? Always one. <laughs> I mean, look at that thing. I mean, come on. What do you think that is? About 400 bucks? I mean, yo. I mean, that is a big yacht. I mean, that thing is huge. Probably pretty economical, though. Yeah, that's a big old good one. I'm sure they're living in there, you know what I mean? I mean, I'm sure that's somebody's home. I mean, you can't afford that and something else, can you? This is called Slackle, Slackle, Slackle Ford, Rockford, Texas. And then here's Mr. A little one here, a little one. That's a pretty one there. But you know, having a yacht like that, that's got to be an expensive hobby. I'm, I'm sure, again, like I said, most of these people probably live on them because, you know, I hear air conditioners and heat running and stuff, and these cars are parked here. So I'm sure these people just uh, bought them a yacht or a boat and 
parked it here and live in it. But yeah, it's cold out here, guys. You see that ice on the ground? That's no joke. But anyway, to uh, Sailing Magic Carpet and Sailing Uma, now I've got a little bit of a feel. It's been a long time since I've been down to a marina. And, uh, but anyway, so you guys be careful out there. And I'll be careful out in the western USA and southern parts of the USA, wherever I go. And yeah, there's a little similarity. The, the real similarity is just the is spirit of adventure. You know, whether you're an RVer or a sailor or what, you just want to be doing something a little bit adventurous. What is an adventure? Uh, something that stimulates your, what, thinking that uh, increases your reach in the universe. Yeah, that's pretty neat, isn't it? But anyway, guys, let's uh, end this. And again, you young couples out there on the ocean making money on YouTube and enjoying your life, don't get carried away. Money ain't everything. I mean, it's a lot. I'll give you that. Without it, you ain't got crap. In fact, how do you spell dignity? C-A-S-H. Because if you don't have any C-A-S-H, you don't have any D-I-G-N-I-T-Y, I guarantee you. So, from the marina again, here in Rockport, Texas, this is Rusty78609, heading to get back in that warm motorhome of his right over here and thaw my hands out. Would I want to be a sailor? No. No, I get seasick. E even sailors get seasick. I mean, but, but I mean, I get seasick and I don't like it. I even got seasick on the ocean. I mean, I went on four cruises, and when the, the old cruise ship that's, you know, I don't know, 800 feet, 1,000 feet long, whatever it is, you know, they get moving at night, 28 to 30 knots, and yeah, that little motion, oh, kills me. Anyway, guys, thumbs up, Carpe Diem, adios, bye bye, buy anything you want anytime. But if you think about it, send me a heater. No, I'm kidding, 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 kidding. Uh, yeah, if you think about it, uh, use the link to Amazon products in the description of all my videos. Why, 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 why? Because it doesn't cost you a penny. You just click on the link, go to Amazon, buy whatever your little heart desires, and life's good. And that is the Gulf of Mexico somewhere out there. So anyway, guys, stay warm. Adios. Bye-bye.